A pile old fence timber. Shave it up, clean it up. Once you give them a good shave, they actually turn out to be very, very nice, smooth hardwood timber. And if there's any imperfections, shave them to perfection. Brush off any exceeds, trim them to size, and they're ready to build. Always pre jewel before you nail them in. Doesn't matter small or large nails. I am building a 80 centimeter wide table by 60 centimeter and the height of 50 centimeter. This table is perfect for the outdoor barbecue. I'll be installing wheels on them so it can be easily being manure around in the alfresco area. Don't forget to let it dry, check for any gaps, seal them, clean them, give it a good sand. After sanding, measure the centre cutout, ready to install the top. And then I'm going to build the bottom piece by using a router to cut out a channel for the base to fit on for a solid fit. Once that's been done, work out approximately where the cooktop will go in place. Can I press this? Ready? Before measuring it up, make sure the cooktop lid goes to one side, so you leave one side for the oil cup, XC oil from cooking to sit. <laughs> Done. So how does that feel, Emilia? Was the right? Uh, yeah. <laughs> how did you do wrong way? Let's the left. Okay. Now lift to the left. Now lift to the right. Lift to the left. Is uh, yeah. Excellent. Now we can proceed to. Oiling, turn it over, we'll apply oil from the bottom up, by doing that we use clear varnish, mix 50 portion, 50 portion of mineral turf laid to give that um, thin look and semi matte gloss finish to bring out those redness in the hardwood timber. As the timber being sitting out as a fence for I think at least 50 years after they've been shaved off the skin and the hardwood present beautifully. Once it's done at the bottom base we we'll flip it over and we start to do the top side. The top side I recommend it to give two coats that way it give a long lasting wearing and any patch ups, we need to give it a few coats and leave it dry. I hope you guys like the table I have done here. Now I've got a pre jewel and set the bottom base to hold the cooktop. <laughs> now it's in, clean it up, ready for lunch. Haha, -ha, that's where the saucer is. For the XC oil to drain. Excellent. Okay, let's get it up. Start cooking.
Mmm, yummy. Hope you guys like this video and the table I've made. If you like it, give us a thumbs up. Share it to friends. Maybe you can build one for yourself and show me a video of yours. And we look forward to see you in the next video. Cheers, guys.